afternoon. This is Jim Lakey with news and announcements for St. John and Maxville, Kansas on Cable Channel 3 and on sandylandcenter.org, our website. Today is Friday. It's the 8th of June already, and the temperature in the square at noon is 80 degrees. We're having a sunny day today. The high will be 89. And in fact, it'll uh, be sunny for the two days after that. Saturday, sunny and windy, and Sunday, just plain sunny. 94 on uh, Saturday, 92 on Sunday. <coughs> then on uh, Monday, there's a possibility of isolated thunderstorms. The high temperature, 93. And whenever they say there's a 30% chance <coughs> Uh, we mentioned that, but we don't have a lot of courage about getting rain when there's a 30% chance. Then on Tuesday, pilot cloudy and 89, and on Wednesday, cloudy and 89. So it'll be a little cooler uh, in the coming week. <coughs> happy birthday today uh, to Jerry Kinnaman, and a very special happy birthday to Dorothy Tucker. Uh, she's 94 today setting a good example for all of us. Uh, tomorrow, happy birthday to Di Fisher. And on Sunday, happy birthday to Marie Hager. <coughs> well, we have a little update on uh, some of the county events that are happening, particularly the uh, election of county commissioners that take place. And in uh, District 2, which is uh, Maxville, uh, Roger Fanchier, the incumbent, is running for re-election. And Shane uh, Steinmates is uh, running there uh, for that seat. <coughs> in District 3, which is uh, St. John, uh, our commissioner is uh, retiring. And uh, so there are four uh, running for county commissioner in the St. John uh, District. Uh, James Doran, uh, Kurt Fairchild, uh, Tom Hodges, and Jerry Munden. And so we will have an interesting uh, situation where you have four people running. And I don't think we've seen that for a long time for anybody running for a county commissioner. <coughs> and then, uh, We'll do the recreation, which is the ones that have the most announcements left. Uh, June 13th, which is uh, Wednesday, uh, they're going to Greensburg. Tour of the well and the visitor center. They leave at 8, and you get lunch at your own expense. Return by 4. Then on uh, Monday the 18th, <coughs> which is a couple of Mondays away, uh, they're having pizza at Humble Pie in St. John, and then they're going shopping in Pratt. And uh, so the lunch is included in the fee. And they meet at the Rec Commission at 11.25, and then they come back by 4. Uh, for any of these trips, you want to call the Rec Commission, the Recreation Commission. And their uh, last digits are 6549. I, I, there ought to be some good way to remember that, like 5409 or something. So uh, call the Rec Commission to make a reservation at 6549. Uh, and enjoy that trip. And then finally, the last trip of the month has usually been, and it is this time, going shopping or the casino in Dodge. And they're leaving at 8, returning at 4. And they have their usual uh, setup where uh, the casino is from 9.30 to 2.30, and shopping is from 10 until 12 noon. And the fee is $10 for transportation. And with this one, they always remind us uh, that they have only 12 uh, seats available uh, because, of course, uh, the driver is, is one of the people, so uh, call early if you plan to go to the casino. <coughs> then, our always uh, ever faithful uh, folks at the Maxwell VIP Center are sending us their menu, and we thank them. 
Uh, today they're having barbecued beef and potato salad. On Monday they're having pork cutlet and baked potato. And on Tuesday, roast beef with gravy and parsley and potatoes. And on Wednesday, chicken and rice casserole. And so uh, if you're a senior, you really don't want to miss out on the fellowship meal in uh, Maxville. It's one of the big attractions over there at lunchtime. Well, the word of the day is this. Willpower is the ability to eat just one salted peanut. This is Jim Lakey, hoping you'll have a terrific weekend.